Hey, everybody. It's Big B. I am actually opening up some Topps Baseball. I've got uh, a partially partially open box here. I'm just going to see what I've got. I have uh, been trying to look for a Barry Bonds, some Bo Jacksons, and things like that. So I'm just seeing what we have here. Um, let me know how the video quality is. I'll show you some of the cards as I go through, but I love this gum. See that nasty gum on the back there? Looks like we've got, uh, this is my first live, by the way, so it's going to be rough. Checking out the quality, seeing what's going on here. Of course, the one with the gum on it's Gary Carter. Nasty gum. Let's see who else we got in here. Mike. Jim Leland. Manager. Got another manager. Mr. Keith Hernandez. Before he used the gray. Fix his hair. Todd Worley. I don't th I think that's actually a decent card. I'm not sure. Some of these cards have massive spots on them, too. Put these to the side. So I've heard, how's everybody doing tonight? See if we can get anybody on here. I'm going to continue to open up. Again, we're opening 1987 baseball. Seeing what we have on. Looking for some Barry Bonds, Jose Canseco. Got a checklist. Dave Concepcion. Dave. Sparky Anderson. There's Reggie Jackson. For some reason, I'm thinking that um, I know that uh, Bo Jackson and uh, Jose Canseco – He's in there. So, so far, we really haven't picked up anything big. The other day, I did pull some of these. I opened up some of the packs already. And I got uh, Mr. Roger Clemens. And I got uh, Don Manningly's All-Star. That's a decent card. So we're going to keep them, and I've actually applied to get on to whatnot to start selling because we've got Funko Pops and, and things like that that we're going to be selling on there. But my luck, that Barry Bonds is going to have the gum on it. I just know he will. Kelly Gruber, that's actually a good card. I think that's – if that comes – let me see. Uh, that's not too bad, but if that one comes back at 10, that's about a $180 card right there. I think it's what it's worth. Let me see if there's a value on here real quick. That's, uh, what card number is that? 458. That stuff is just nasty. Will Clark. Oh, there's Cal Ripken. That's a decent card. Oh, there's a Roger Clemens All-Star. It's a nice card, too. Again, we're opening up 1987 baseball. So we got unopened packs, 1987 baseball. We're going to open these up. 
I've got some channels in the background I'm watching as well. You guys want to jump in and watch me open them up? You're more than welcome to. If you got any comments for me, keep them clean. I'll be glad to see if I can help you answer them. Keep them clean. I'll be glad to see if I can help you answer them. Mr. Ron Darling. Brett Sapahagan. Terry Fracone. Keep that one. Joe Youngblood. Again, we're looking for, the, I've got 1987 baseball. We are looking for Barry Bonds. And this is my first live. I don't really know what I'm doing. I'm just opening up some packs of cards. I figure I'd sit here and talk to somebody if they want to jump on. More than welcome to jump on. Don't see anybody yet. There's that piece of gum again. That stuff looks nasty. Go ahead and put this. We got Dennis Eckersley. I think that's it. Was that before? Yeah, that was before the A's. So he was with the Indians, the Red Sox, and the Cubs. And then I guess he went to the A's after that. Billy Bean. Oh, there's uh, Bobby Bonilla. I think that's a good card as well. Let's see what that one is on. What's his card number? 184. Let's see if we got a value on that one. That's eh, about a $30 card. It's not bad. Again, we've got 1987 baseball. I've got about, uh, let's see, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen packs of cards. So we'll continue to open them up. Then I think I've got a uh, late 80s NFL. Um, I've got some NBA and I think I got a couple more baseballs that I've got coming in. I'm not sure exactly. Terry Pendleton, Pendleton, Mike Young, John Henry Jones. I don't see anybody that's – oh, there we go. I pulled a Barry Bonds. That right there, let me see. It's a little off-center. If you look on this side over here, it's a little off-center versus this side. So it'll probably come back like around a 9 So that's only going to be like $30. I'll keep it. It's a fun card. And then I've got uh, All-Star of Wade Boggs. That's probably about a, I don't know, it's probably like a $30, $40 card. And we've got Tops Baseball, 1987, if you're just jumping in. Thanks for coming in. Thanks for watching. I just do this for fun. Mike's, Mike Kingery? Kingery? Dale Murphy. It's just funny. Sometimes I try to pronounce these names, and this, there's no chance of me pronouncing these names. Steve Sachs. 
Oh, we got some good Phillies coming out. There's Dar Darren Dalton. I'll just keep that for my private collection. So, again, we were looking for Barry Bonds. We're looking for some Don Mattingly, Bo Jackson's rookie card. And I think there's actually uh, – let me look it up real quick. Who we got here? Yeah, we got a Barry Bonds rookie card. Oops. Got a bunch of Cal Ripkins, Kirby Puckett. I got some Roger Clemens. Still haven't found a Bo Jackson yet. Hershizer. Oral Hershizer. If you look on the bottom by his name, I don't know if you'll come up. There's a bunch of spots around his name. That's not quality, but. There's that wonderful gum again. I've actually heard stories on how they make how they made that gum. No, thank you. Will Clark. There's another Cal Ripken. Kevin Mitchell. That's a nice looking card. It's an action card right there. It's a nice looking card. Let's see where it needs to go out. If I do like a focus on that, it's a nice looking card. All right, let's keep going. See what else we can find. <clears throat> Nineteen eighty-seven baseball. Seventeen cards in the pack. That's back when you actually got some cards when you were in a pack. Don't see anything decent in this pack yet. Uh, it's one of those throwaway packs. Nothing in there. Nothing worth looking at. We've got what? Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven packs left. Be nice to grab another Barry Bonds or a Bo Jackson, Jose Canseco, Don Mattingly. Let's see what we can get. Ooh, this would be nice for myself. We got a Mike Schmidt. Which way should that go? Does it go better if I do something like that? No, it's not focusing on it that well. We got Mike Schmidt, Tommy Lasorda. I'll show you the Tommy Lasorda. Actually, on that card, he's just Tom Lasorda. Yeah, I just need to bring it back like that, I guess. There's Moose, Big Moose. That's kind of a neat one there. Phillies leaders. What we got on there? Oh, it just goes through the different leaders. I keep that for myself. Different leaders. I keep that for myself. Got a lot of buddies that are the Orioles fans. There's Earl Weaver. Or if it's the lighting in here that's making it do that. Eddie Murray. It's a thicker card. So we're jumping in on 1987 baseball. And I've got other stuff in the background I'm watching as I'm doing this. Keep myself entertained. Pat Clement. There's a Kirby Puckett. 
Kirby Puckett. Don Sisk. And there's another Roger Clemens All Star card. Rick Honeycutt. Terry Fra Francone. It's a nice card. It's funny to look back at these players. 1987 was a while ago. Was I in middle school? Was I in middle school in 87? Yeah, no. Yeah, I would have been in... Uh, yeah, I would have been in eighth grade. 1987 Tops Baseball. Barry Bonds. Bo Jackson. Crossing my fingers. <clears throat> Jim Clancy. Bill Campbell. Chuck Finley. George Bell. So what we got left. We got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight more packs of cards. Then we'll look through and see what we got, see what we think that they're valued at. It's a 1987 Tops Baseball. I might, once I go through, try to make a set out of it. We're trying to get a whatnot set up. So we can set up on there and uh, I'll Von Hayes with the Phillies. Von Hayes. I'm going to keep him for my personal collection. Um, we're going to set up on whatnot and uh, see if we can actually get some, some stuff sell, selling on there. We have an eBay page. Uh, my sports seven underscore seventy three. We have stuff on there like eighties baseball. We've got a couple nineties basketball, eighties basketball, um, bunch of Funko Pops. Uh, you know, so if you want to check it out, we've got a lot of stuff on there. Nineteen eighty seven tops baseball. Come on, Let's see what we can get. John Ray, Tommy John. It's an interesting card right there. Come on, focus on me. Tommy John. Charles Hudson, it's a Philly. Sean Dunstan, what year is that for him? Would that have been his first year? 87? I don't know if this is his rookie card or not. I'll keep it to the side for now. Lenny Dykstra, of course it's got the gum on the back of it. I'm sure it's not worth much. But. <clears throat> 1987 baseball. Let's see. Come on, Bo Jackson. I th I've got one Barry Bond so far. It's off-centered, but it's all right. Still pulled it. Well, there's a Ricky Henderson there. It's a nice card. Take that, see if we can find a price on that one. 1986 record breaker, Dwight, record breaker, Dwight Evans. 
Check that one out. All right, we're going to go through, see what we can get. Again, this is my very first live. I'm just opening a pack of 1987 baseball, Tops baseball. See what we can find. There's a Wade Boggs. <clears throat> oh, man, what else we got here? Oh, that card's way off center. So far, we've pulled one Barry Bonds, some Kirby Puckets, Roger Clemens, Cal Ripken. I've got four packs left. 1987 Tops Baseball. Mike Davis. Lonnie Smith. Franklin Stubbs, Billy Sample, Bill Mooneyham, Mooneyham, hmm. here's a checklist, check us, sometimes there's checklist or, oh, there's a Jose Canseco, it's got, looks like it's got a spot on the back. Jose Canseco. We got three packs left. <clears throat> My allergies are killing me for some reason right now. I don't know what's going on. It's probably all that smoke from Canada. Rob Deere, Mark Davis, Alan Ashby, John Russell. Oh, are you kidding me? Isn't that Ron Gertie? Isn't that a... No, I don't see him on the top list. There's a Tony Gwynn All-Star card. <clears throat> we got two packs left. Let's see what we can find. Still looking for a Bo Jackson. I've got the Barry Bonds. Let's see if we can find a Bo Jackson. There's a Dusty Baker. Actually, I... Just pulled his. I opened up a what was that 1983 pack of cards the other day, and I pulled his card. Joe Price, Andre Dawson, but of course, it's got that nasty gum on the back. Joe Youngblood. Jose Guzman. <clears throat> this gum is leaving residue all over this mat. It's disgusting. Last pack. 1987 baseball. We got a 1986 record breaker. Roger Clemens. Dick Williams. There we go. Bo Jackson All-Star. Looks like it's a little off center. It's a little more space on this side than on this side. Hey, we'll take it. Rick Sutcliffe. 
Sammy Stewart. That was fun. Just opened up a box of 1987 baseball. So we've got uh, we've got a couple checklists. I always like to keep the checklist because sometimes those things are worth a little bit. We've got uh, 1986 record breaker, Roger Clemens. We've got Steve Baker. It's a nice card. Who else? Oh, yeah, I was looking for a Jose Canseco. Found one of them. Jose Canseco. That will definitely be sleeved up. We got some Wade Boggs. There's a Ricky Henderson. I'm not sure how much that one's worth. But I do know I do know the Bo Jackson, the Jose Canseco, and the Barry Bonds. If they come back at ten, that's if they come back at ten. They're worth about one hundred and fifty, one hundred and eighty dollars a piece. I don't think the Barry Bonds is going to come back at ten. It's definitely off centered. The Bo Jackson's probably going to be a nine. I think that one's like thirty five dollars out of nine. And then uh, the Jose Canseco, it's got a blemish down by the name, and it's got, I believe it's got a spot on the back. Yeah, it's got some gum residue on the back. So I'll probably just keep those. I don't know if I'm going to get them graded or not, but we got Tommy John, Mo Vaughn, another Roger Clemens. I'm going to keep that one up there. Kirby Puckett, I've got two of those. Mike Schmidt, that's going in my personal collection. There's another Cal Ripken. I got a buddy of mine. He collects Cal Ripken, so I'll probably just give him those cards. Bobby Monia. Terry Francone. Got a couple of those. There's another Roger Clemens that has more gum crap on the back of it. That gum was destroying some of these cards. There's a Reggie Jackson. It's a nice card. I don't think it's worth much, but it's kind of a nice card for history. Another, That's a good manager right there. Sparky Annan. Keith Hernandez. I sell Keith Hernandez cards like crazy on eBay. I don't, I don't get why. I mean, and granted, he was a good player, but I think people just like him. The nostalgic. The other day, I pulled, a, I pulled a Roger Clemens card. Uh, I pulled a couple um, Ricky Henderson cards, and then I pulled a Don Mattingly All Star cards. I've already sleeved those up. So we're gonna go ahead and end this right now. We've. Enjoyed time. I've enjoyed a lot of time opening this box of cards just to see in the history. Um, but like I say every time, that was fun. Now it's your turn. Go out and have fun, and we'll see you on the next one.